Well, good morning, everyone, and thank you for coming out this morning. Uh, it's great to be here, and it's nice to be able to come to Detroit with some good news. Motor Trend's Truck of the Year evaluation is not a comparison test. Those of you who have been in the industry a long time will know we do this. Um, we broke out Truck of the Year from the Of the Year programs when it became clear that pickup trucks became a very large slice of the American market. And despite what's happened with gas, despite what's happened with the credit crunch, despite the collapse in consumer confidence that's currently decimating the market, the pickup truck remains the backbone of the American automotive scene. That's not going to change. The pickup truck is America's workhorse. Small businesses rely on the pickup truck. Construction, farmers, and also a lot of people still want a pickup truck because it suits the American lifestyle. This is a big country. This is a country with a lot of active people who enjoy an active lifestyle. The pickup truck is here to stay. It's not going away, despite what some people in the mainstream media might think, despite what some of the politicians in Washington might think. Vehicles like this are here to stay. So how do we get to truck of the year? The evaluation process that Motor Trend goes through takes about a week. We start with all our usual battery of performance tests, the usual 0 to 60, standing quarter mile, the braking tests, the figure eight and the slalom. We run all the numbers with all the trucks and, and the eligible trucks are those new vehicles which have been launched during the year. And this year, it was a very close run thing because this year, although it's not a comparison test, naturally, there was a head-to-head -head, uh, rivalry between the Ford F-150 and Dodger's Ram, two trucks aimed at more or less uh, identical customer segments. There were some key, different, key differences between the two approaches, though. It became obvious to the judges that Ford had concentrated on the core values of the pickup truck the capability of the pickup truck. To us, the F-150 seemed a thorough and thoughtful rework of a very well-proven formula. Every area that we experienced with the truck, there had been noticeable improvements over the predecessor. The steering, the ride quality, the redesign, the exterior look, the interior fit and finish. With the uh, crew cab version here, we were impressed with the extra room inside and clever features like the way the seats fold up. So having gone through the process, checked it off against the criteria, you know, in terms of, of superiority, the advancement in design, the engineering excellence, the strength uh, and the capability, uh, the payload, the towing capacity. Significance. I mean, the F-150 still is this country's best-selling vehicle, still is the world's best-selling vehicle. Um, and the evolution of the F-150 into the 21st century, this truck takes that concept in the right direction. And of course, in value, you know, you can go from a base work truck all the way up to one of the fully loaded King Ranch or Platinum versions. Now, the market dynamics are changing. Um, one thing that is very clear is that the world we've all known and grown used to over the past uh, you know, 30 or 40 years in Detroit is changing. But I keep coming back to the point that at the end of the day, its pro product is king. That's what we're all here for. You know? This thing didn't emerge out of nowhere. There are people in this room, every one of you, in some way, has something to do with this vehicle. You're invested in this vehicle. And it's the same with every Ford product, every Lincoln Mercury product that is out in the marketplace. There's a little bit of your heart and soul in every one of these vehicles. And that's what drives us in, in our business. We're looking for that passion. We're looking for that commitment. We're looking for that desire to always do a product that stands out from the rest. And in terms of the truck category, the contenders for this year, which included Suzuki Equator, Hummer H3T, and the Dodge Ram, it came down to the truck of the year, 
Ford's F-150. So from, from my team, I'd like to congratulate everyone here and everyone who can't be here for their work in developing this vehicle, designing, engineering, manufacturing, and now the work of marketing and selling it. Well done, and I'd like to invite uh, Derek Kuzak up. Derek. Thank you. Well, thanks, Agnes. That was just an outstanding set of remarks. And I'd like to thank you and the Motor Trend editorial staff for being here with us today. I actually couldn't have said it much better. And uh, good morning to the Ford team. I can't tell you how pleased I am to see the turnout we've had today. It's just absolutely outstanding. Because I think all of us recognize, and as you just indicated, Great trucks and great products are delivered by a team of hundreds, even thousands of people who dedicate themselves, their expertise, their skills, their customer knowledge, their commitment, and yes, a lot of just sheer work and diligence to deliver a great vehicle. As I said, the, and Derek's right, this is a team effort. You know, a lot of people say thank you to Motor Trend team, but actually, really, this is down to you. It was your truck that did it. Your truck best met the criteria. And uh, Derek, without further ado, I guess uh, we should probably sure. unveil the award. That sounds great. Thank you. All right, well, without putting a damper on such a great moment, let me just make a few comments. Again, I'd really like to thank the Motor Trend team, and as uh, Angus indicated, it was really interesting when he talked about their test procedures and their comparison, because what he indicated is what they evaluated the truck, just like truck customers do. So that's why it's such a gratifying award for us. And also, this award is probably the most recognized award in the industry, which makes it an even greater honor for us. Now, this is the third time that the F-150s won the award, uh, won it in 97 and 2004. So I think that's a recognition of the fact that we, as a team, understand what cus truck customers want, and we try to go after and meet those unmet needs. And this truck is representative of doing that again, whether it's unsurpassed fuel economy, best-in-class towing and payload, or new smart technology like SYNC, Ford Works solution, or a gate that gets you into the bed, either front, I'm sorry, either rear or side. Those are the kind of attributes and features that truck customers are looking for, and the truck team is delivering them. Now, this year, we're on to 32 straight years of truck leadership, and that again comes from knowing customers. And all of this delivery is getting recognized. It's recognized by a great award, and it's recognized by increasing segment share. Certainly, this has been a difficult year for trucks as the market has decreased. But we, we are increasing segment share. In November, the F-Series was at 37% of the full-size pickup segment. That's five percentage points better than last year. Five percentage points better. So customers are recognizing what we're doing, and they're responding. For us at Ford, uh, winning this award, to me, is like winning the Stanley Cup. It really is. 